Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario! Last time, all the baby Yoshis ran away. Fortunately, they are not going to be screaming and crying, as would happen with Baby Mario! That's another game. But here, we got new enemies. So let's check them out. What do we got here? Hurt plant. Something like a baby piranha plant? Or... I don't know. But yeah, uh, some of them, they give you hearts, like you saw last time. Others want to eat your heart out, I guess. But anyway, yeah, they, uh, they, along with a lot of other enemies here, can poison you. So hopefully you got that feeling fine badge. If you don't, well, then you could use the refresh star power to uh, cure poison. But I don't need to worry about that. I'm just going to have Mario do the heavy lifting for this one. And hopefully I can block this guy's attack. Whoa! I'm surprised I actually timed that right. I thought it was a little late on that one. Well, there we are. I'm surprised I blocked all the damage for that matter. But anyway, Zap Tap gives us a little extra damage too. Not that it's critical. I would rather have feeling fine, but this works too. But, alright, well if I did take damage I could get hearts from that one. Now yeah, let's see what's behind this bush. Whoa! It looked like those guys uh, in the background in Forever Forest or something. Okay, well, we got another new one here. M Bush. What is that? Monster Bush? Or, I don't know. I don't know what the M stands for. But anyway, yeah, they also have 8 HP and can poison you just like almost everyone else here. Sorry if I'm going through this a little quickly. I don't have anything that can deal 8 damage to all enemies, so I'm just going to have to uh, stick with what I got. If only there were an item that would let me deal more damage to all enemies. Eh. Too late on that one. Oh wow. Well. But yeah, one, you, you want to time your block against them, like right after they jump. Or right as they jump. And, uh... Yeah, I didn't do that. Oh yeah, by the way, since last time, I uh, cleared out my inventory, deposited the two, uh, what is it, coconuts, the jam and jelly, and the repel gel. So really the important thing is the uh, the two coconuts, because we'll need those for later. Okay, that's everything we can do here. Can't do anything with that wooden stand back there, or whatever that thing is. Well, someone looks like they need some help. Any coins here? No? Okay. Well, then let's see what's going on over here. Hey, okay, how's it going? Ah, Sushi, how'd you get all the way up there? Well, I suppose uh, Cheap Cheeps can jump really high out of water if Mario 1 never taught us anything. Well, let's see, how many more do we need? Three, just like a Tootsie Pop. Well, okay, shouldn't you have, like, jumped into the water? I mean, you're a fish. What trap? Maybe that's why they wanted to uh, go into the jungle. Uh, to rescue you and do your job for you? Yep, got a letter to deliver to them that I forgot to do last time. Oh, well, not that it's critical. I mean, we'll get that, do that eventually, anyway. Spoiler alert, we're actually going to rescue the kids. How do you not know my name? You and all your relatives have been trying to kill me for, well, let's see, what, 15 years or 16 since the first Mario game? With the Cheap Cheeps? Well, anyway, well, nice and tropical here. I like the atmosphere, I just don't like the heat. But anyway, now we got more party members! So what does Sushi do? Oh, so that's what all those wooden platforms are for. So yeah, now we could go to, or go back to Toad Town if we wanted to, and there's some wooden planks over there too. I'm not gonna do that right now, but remember that for later. Let's see, nothing in the tree there. Well, there's a star piece over there, but I can't get there. Whatever shall we do? Well, let's put our new party member to use. Sushi? Yeah, press C down, 
and you can go into water with her. You can also uh, press C down to uh, dive underwater. Sometimes there'll be items there, or you wanna go under a log like that, or you wanna get to an island with a letter to deliver. But anyway, let's see what's on the uh, other island over here. Hey, okay, how's it going? You got the last uh, magical seed that I need? I've already gotten three of them. We're gonna need that fourth one soon. Oh, well, good for you. Hmm? Oh. That's... I mean, uh, seeds. Okay, well, keep that in mind. Hopefully we'll be able to get it before the next uh, chapter. But anyway, okay, that's everything we can do here. Let's see, I don't think there's anything to the left. Nah, nothing we can do there. Okay, well, let's get back on land and... I'll continue back to the left now that we got sushi. We got more areas we can explore in the jungle around here. More enemies to fight. Hiding in bushes and trees. Who knows what. What's that sound? Hmm. Oh, hey, there's a little Yoshi up there, but I, I can't quite reach that place. Oh, well. Uh, let's see. You know what? Let's bring in Cooper for this one. All right, and got a new level, so let's get our FP up to 20. Basically, I want to get uh, one, one more HP gain, and then I'm going to put the rest into FP until I max it out at 50. But anyway, we got another more powerful badge, Power Quake. Basically, same thing as the regular one, except it's, well, more powerful. So, uh, yeah, I believe it deals two more damage than the regular Quake Hammer, if I recall correctly. So I want to get rid of Zap Tap so I can equip... The, both of them for different situations and let's see for the remaining two let's bring back dizzy attack unfortunately a lot of enemies like the bushes you can't dizzy attack them because they well come out of nowhere before you can attack them so oh wow well. but anyway new badge and we can't get up to that tree yet so let's just keep on going to the left Ah, there's a super block. Yeah, we could have gone back to Toad Town Tunnels for that, but nah, we don't. Well, we got one right here, so why bother going back? Okay, let's see what we got on this side. Hmm? Who's that? Strange noise. Hey, hey, all right. Not that I need it since I gained a level, but whatever works. Oh, yeah, something else you could do. You go down here. Ha ha! Takes you right back to the start. Not that. We really need to do that, but it's there. Yeah, I heard that the first time. You got any coins for me? Hey, hey all right. Uh, where's that Yoshi kid? I can hear them making noise. Well, anyway, we got a whole bunch of these guys, so let's take them out with our new Power Quake. Works exactly the same as the original. And then we'll bring in... Uh, Cooper to finish them off. Fortunately, I got Flower Finder, so I'm not extraordinarily worried about how much flower points I'm using. So that's how you deal with eight HP enemies. If they only have seven, then you could go just a regular Quake Hammer with uh, Cooper there, too. Okay, so let's see. Right here. Hey! Maybe you shouldn't have ran off. Ah. Oh. Well, I took care of you. Or, take care of it for you. Yep. Darn young whippersnappers. Okay, so anyway, let's see. Let's get back and... We want to get up to the central area there. You know, we need to get there in order to get to the lower right for the super black for Susu. Man, we're almost uh, running out of uh, uh, super blocks for everyone. But anyway, can I jump? Ha ha! Not that I'm gonna use it, but it's there. All right, easy enough. Just a couple of those guys. 
Get another coin from the tree. Can the bell plant do anything? No? Okay, never mind. Okay, so I think we got all the coins there. So let's see, another one over here. Uh, it's so nice when all those spear guys align their hammers, or not hammers, um, spears in the same direction. Makes it a whole lot easier to kill them all. And it looks like I'm getting over leveled again. Enemies aren't giving me nearly as much experience anymore. Oh well. But I do want to upgrade my new member, so let's do that. I don't really use sushi that much. I mean, outside of platforming and stuff. I can't use... The, she gets an attack that can hit all enemies, but I'm like really bad at entering in the commands for that. So I don't really use her that much. Oh well. But anyway, okay, so we did everything here. Well, let's go on up here. I think this is where I want to go. Okay, what do we got here? Aha, coin number one. I think there's another one behind the bush somewhere. Grab this one or... Whoa! What's going on? What is that thing anyway? I mean, it's some kind of plant, but... Hmm, that's weird. But anyway, I know there's another coin. Haha! -ha! Gotcha. Alright, there were two of those bushes, but I took them out easily enough. And... Another fright jar. Has, like, in any JRPG, has making your enemies run away ever been useful? I don't think I've ever seen that... I mean, maybe Final Fantasy 2, because you can uh, still get, like, skill points or stat boosts, but yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't use it there. But anyway, let's see. Get up here. Awesome. All right, easy enough. There were some jungle fuzzies there, but they're pretty uncommon around here. So, yeah, I'm not really worried about them anymore than like equipping zap tap we got better stuff to use now anyway but anyway in this cave here can i get up there hey okay hey, how's it going how'd you get in here anyway nuts maybe you should have brought a flashlight with you I did. Good idea. Okay, well, let's get out. Let's join him. Get out of here. I don't think there's anything else in uh, in this part of the jungle here. Let's see. Sushi, work your magic. Well, swimming isn't really magic, but you know what I mean. But anyway, yeah, we can go over here. Well, let's see. Before going onto that platform, I want to go behind this area. Come on, Sushi, you can do better than that. All right. Kind of reminds me of the swimming physics in uh, Ocarina of Time. Personally, I like the swimming physics with the Zora mask and Majora's mask better, but this works too. Any other enemies? No? Oh, that was easy. Just hiding in plain sight, huh? To enemies are totally not waiting and to ambush me, right? Uh, sure, why not? All the enemies are drawn to me anyway. So, anyway. I don't think there's anything behind any of these plants, but just to make sure. Okay, that's everything we can do here. Let's get back and, well, we gotta go back two screens, I guess, so we can, uh, well, go right two screens, not exactly back. You know what I mean. Can I get there on, on water or land? I forget. I'm gonna get off the water. Yeah, yeah, I thought it was on land. Uh, well, what do we got here? Okay, took care of uh, those guys there. Now, there was another spear guy over here, if, it, if I didn't get it on camera there, but... Oh, yeah, I suppose I kind of glossed over this. Yeah, whenever you see one of those stumps of a tree or something there, yeah, you, it makes a bridge for you. But I, I thought that was obvious. Yeah, there's another hurt plane around here, too, but... Oh, well. These guys are attacking in bunches. Can I go to the right? Yes, I can, but I don't want to yet. I, oh, wait. No, I can't use uh, use any of that, can I? Okay. Never mind, then. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's get 
sushi out here. We got some more treasure we can get. Well, okay, just one coin, but yeah. Well, but now we need to get under this log. The sushi can help with that. Let's see. Got that. I think there's one right here. Hmm. Hmm. What's with this statue? Hmm. That's weird. Remember that for later, viewers. Now, let's see. I could go south. That'll loop back around to the first area. But I'm going to save that for last because I want to get back to the village eventually. So let's not do that. Let's go up here instead. What's going on? Well, let's, uh... Whoa! Those guys are back here too, huh? Okay, let's bring Goombario out because we've got new enemies coming up. Grab a little coin before saving the baby Yoshi's life. He deserves it. We can take these guys. They got a lot more HP. So, Goombario, do your research. Wow, that's not very tough at all. Ah, yeah, more poison. Ah, okay. Alright, well, I'll keep that in mind, I guess. But anyway, yeah, I'm just going to use Mega, or Power Quake. Sorry. I was thinking Ma Mega Magic, but no, no, that's not yet. Oh, I don't think it'll be enough to do anything. Well, it's there, I guess. Oops. That was easy enough. Okay. Yeah, Mario, why don't you just uh, finish him off with a regular Quake Hammer? Normally, I would have used two Power Quakes, but I didn't expect uh, Merle to help me out at that exact moment. Okay, I think that's, what, four of them? So, one more to go. Talk about Venus flytraps. Okay, well, I don't think there's any anything else behind the bushes there, so... Let's head on back. Where... Okay, now we want to go back to the first area. But this will take us to uh, a different section. Remember there was that Yoshi that I couldn't reach before in the tree? Well, now we can! And someone's sleeping on the job. Whoa! Alright, took care of those guys. And let's see. Hey, get out of your tree! You fall for your own trap? Like same one you used on sushi. Yeah, we were all kind of looking for you. Sounds like a plan. All right, got them all. So now we need to make a quick retreat back to the village. So grab a little coin here for my efforts. Oh, another one. Cool. And let's make a bridge. That'll take us right back to the start. Oh, and you know what? I got that letter to deliver. So let's get Paracarry out to do that. I think this takes us back to the start. Yeah, it does. Okay. Hey. I've got something for you. A letter. Paracarry. And these kids never learn. But yeah, now we can finally deliver that letter we got so long ago. What's it about, anyway? How does anyone even know to mail something to you guys? I mean, I mean, Sushi didn't even know I existed, apparently. Do you like a pen pal or something? Well, I suppose uh, Paracarry can just fly to deliver the letters. But, alright! Well, we could take that back to uh, deliver it to him, but uh, well, not right now. But how are we going to find a way to get to the Mount Lava Lava? Find out next time on Let's Play Paper Mario! This is H.G. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day!